Getting started on YouTube can be an easy task, but when it comes to your audience finding your videos, it can be an uphill struggle. The problem is that you put your heart and soul into your content and then nobody watches your videos and you start wondering whether or not it's worth continuing on the platform. But what if I told you that there are a few things that if you changed, that's gonna change the game for you on YouTube forever. All you have to do is just stick around till the end of this video because I'm gonna give you all the tips and tricks that you need to transform the game on the platform forever. So the first problem that you're facing is that you have a low number of impressions. And let me explain what an impression is. An impression refers to your thumbnail being seen by other people on the platform, whether in the suggested videos or on the homepage on YouTube. And your task is to convince people to click on your thumbnail or on the title to watch your video. So if people are not watching your thumbnails or your titles, you get low numbers of impressions and that's the beginning of the problem. So you need to recognize it and nip it in the bud before it becomes the case for all your videos and that's gonna be a waste of time and effort since you put your heart and soul into making your videos. So the first thing that we have to work on is your thumbnail. And I understand that it can be so, so hard, especially when YouTube is so oversaturated right now. There are literally 700,000 hours being uploaded to the platform every single day. And that's crazy because it means that the competition is incredibly intense. And for you as a small YouTuber, it's doubly intense since you're competing with large channels in your niche. But don't worry about it. I have the solution for you. There are a few things that you have to realize before you start to make any thumbnails. First off, they have to be simple and to the point. So avoid cluttering your thumbnail with too much information or avoid decluttering it to the point where your audience don't really understand what your video is about and then they're gonna click on another video. So my advice to you is that you have to make your thumbnails before you make the video and edit it and do all the other work. That way you can get a full picture on what you're gonna do in the video and how your thumbnail is gonna be well optimized. Because when we're done making our videos, we're sort of rushed into uploading them and then we end up making half-baked thumbnails and people don't discover our videos and we lose all the work and the effort we put into it. And try to see other thumbnails related to your video topic and try to see what got these people the most views and what didn't. And you might as well send your thumbnails to one of your friends to see whether or not it's visually appealing and it's gonna attract your target audience. And when people see your thumbnail and they like it, they then turn to the title of your video to read it to decide whether your video is worth watching or not. So if your videos are not getting discovered, that means that your thumbnails are not optimized and we talked about it and your titles are not good enough for your target audience to find you. And that makes your video title the second most important component of your video. Because if it doesn't correspond with your thumbnail, people are not gonna watch or even click on your video. So your title has to trigger clicks. And if you use the formula that I'm gonna give you in this video, I guarantee you that you're gonna see success in no time on YouTube. So first of all, don't be afraid of using clickbait. If you check out all the best performing channels on the platform, you're gonna find out that everybody's using clickbait every now and then. And the formula that I'm gonna give you right now has to be done in every single video. First of all, you have to use 70 to 100 characters in your title. If you look at this title right now, you're gonna see what I mean. It's not too long and it's not too short. And the first 50 characters have to contain the main keyword, the thing that's gonna click trigger and gonna get people to click on your video to watch it. You can use it for one or two words just to emphasize important words or you can use the word without. For example, how to invest money without paying too much taxes. How to make progress on YouTube without buying too much gear. So you get the idea. People are usually lazy and they want to get the end result without doing too much work. So using the word without is gonna do the trick. But if you have a creativity block and you can come up with good titles, I suggest you use tubebranker.com. It's gonna give you a variety of titles, but I suggest you use your own creativity and try to come up with your own titles 
and that way you're gonna get used to it and you're gonna know what resonates more with your audience and yet you're gonna get your subscribers to watch your videos and reach success. So since you got people to click on your thumbnail or your title and decide to watch your video, that's really nice, but you're not out of the woods yet. Your mission is to make people watch as much as possible of your video. And the biggest mistake that a lot of people make is that people talk about themselves in the beginning of the video instead of talking about the problem that they're trying to solve in the video. And if you think about it, it actually makes sense. If you're trying to find a solution to a problem that you're having, why would you watch someone talking about themselves for a few minutes instead of watching a video about the problem that you're trying to solve? So in the beginning of the video, get straight to the point, stop talking about yourself don't beg people to like or subscribe so much because actually people hate it and avoid long intros. Actually for small channels, long intros do more harm than good. So if you don't have an intro in the first place, don't worry, that's not gonna affect your channel. It's actually a good thing. Just go along with your video from the get-go and try to get to what you want to say. All right, so since you optimized your thumbnails and your titles, now you have a good click-through rate. What you need to take care of is your watch time. Because if there are only two things that YouTube care about, they're your click-through rate and your watch time. You can use overlay footage, music, and many more things. But the most effective thing you can use is you can tell people in the beginning of your video that in the end of your video, there's gonna be a tip that's gonna change the game forever. And that's what I did in the beginning of this video. And that way, people are gonna be enticed and interested in knowing what kind of tip you're gonna give them in the end of the video. And if you wanna know more about how to increase your watch time on YouTube, I made a video about it explaining it in detail. You can watch this video by clicking here or I'm gonna give you a link in the description of this video down below. Another mistake that small channels tend to make is that they don't really post consistently. So you have to post consistently so you can gain momentum and get YouTube to realize that your videos are useful to a big chunk of people on the platform so that it can recommend your videos to many more people and get you more subscribers and views. And if you've done all that and you still don't see much progress, I recommend you using Prodvigate. With Prodvigate, in a couple of clicks, you will launch an ads campaign that'll bring you real viewers and views and get your videos to the top of the search results and the suggested videos. And all this without any cheating methods or bots because Prodvigate is an official Google partner. And you don't have to keep trying to figure out Google's advertising settings for eternity because the algorithm of Prodvigate can analyze your channel and get you your target audience in no time. And if you check my promo code in the description of this video, you're gonna get a 12% discount for the first promotion. So that's it for this video guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to smash this like button and click subscribe and let me know in the comments if you have any problems on YouTube right now. Thank you so much and see you next time.